And Laura Ingram was knocking him out of the park. Laura. Blue. Blue. And you go over Maria Bartiromo. And the great Lou Dobbs. How good are they? Lou Dobbs. And many more. And many more. How about Greg? Greg used to hate me. Now he's good. Oh, we can't forget. We can't forget Judge Janine. I would be in such trouble if I forgot Judge Janine. No, these are grand. There are many more. I just, you know, look, I'm just rattling some names off, but they're just terrific people. They're terrific people. But a man that I have to really say something very special about. So I'm watching Fox and Friends early in the morning, very early in the six like slot, because I'm out of there pretty good. And I see a handsome young man named Bob Kroll, cops for Trump. He's talking about this lousy mayor they've got. Now, he didn't quite say that, but I'd say it. He's talking about this lousy mayor that won't let the cops, the police, the law enforcement. You know, my father always used to say, son, he meant it too. Never say cops. It's disrespectful. Say police officer. I say, okay, Bob. But honestly, the truth is with time, I love you guys. Whether you're cops, police officers, law enforcement, I'll call you whatever you want. It doesn't matter. You are so great, so respected. You don't even know how much our public loves you. You don't know it. You don't know it. You don't know it. But I see this guy. And I don't know if he's done a lot of television before, but he was very effective and very good. And he was saying how the police aren't being allowed to take care of this rally. And yet with President Obama and Bush and all these people, they were, you know, fine, fine. Everybody comes, they fall asleep at a rally. But they weren't, they weren't allowed to do the job for us, and they went wild. So what I want to do, Mommy says, I saw you on television tonight. I love Trump. Don't you ever do that again. Yes, Mom. Yes. But the job he did before the election, I came right here to Minnesota, and I pledged to address this really important issue. And it's the issue of law enforcement. And when I saw this man, this great gentleman on television, pouring out his guts, pouring out his heart, I don't know him. He knows I've been good to law enforcement. He knows I've been good to, as my father would say, the police. He knows I love the cops. He knows that. And so does everyone else. I mean, I, it's so many shirts, so many red shirts, and there are plenty of people here without the red shirts. And I want to just tell you the respect that we have for law enforcement is unbound. It's unbound. Come up here, Bob, come up.
What can I say after that? Tune in, Fox 10.